So this all started with the, the Nest Creek Music Festival. You know, they come here to a music festival, but it's right in the midst of the boreal forest. And so just that experience is something that is quite unique to this place. A few years ago, about six years ago, we were reaching the, the, the point where our festival was growing every year and we thought we don't really want to just get bigger and bigger and bigger. And we started looking for groups that would be interested in and utilizing this beautiful space for maybe their own festivals and having more events here throughout the whole year. So we connected with the Bluegrass Society in Saskatoon. Uh, we started a a bluegrass festival. In, a, in combination with that, we have a music camp the week prior to the festival. Uh, this year we had almost a hundred students ranging from, you know, five and six year olds right up to grandmothers and grandfathers. Um, I like to call it uh, ecological cultural destination area where one can come and enjoy the natural beauty but also learn something. We have a young intern and his vision was to have a forest garden with everything from apple trees, Haskap and Saskatoons. We worked with the Pacific uh, Institute of Permaculture and the idea is to have this forest garden as part of a, a teaching program that we could offer to people that come here for all sorts of other events but they're interested in checking out the permaculture. I have two loves, I, uh, music and forest. We've been working with a group called the Boreal Forest Learning Centre which brings high school students here to learn about the natural world, the ecology, uh, forestry, tree planting, uh, stand tending, not so much conventional uh, forestry like logging, but more the, the forest ecology. Uh, we're right on the edge of the Prince Albert National Park. We have uh, the wild bison herd just south of us. Nestlin Lake is one of the most pristine, beautiful lakes uh, in Saskatchewan and probably anywhere in the world. People don't expect to find that here. We've been operating the campground at Nestlin Lake for over 20 years now. We have yurts at Nestlin Lake, and as well as that, we have cabins we rent to people that are holding uh, retreats, but with a focus of the natural beauty and, and, and ecology of the, of the surrounding area. Got back today. Work all the week, honey. I give it all up to you, honey, baby. We are open year round. We have 20 kilometers of cross country ski trail. Uh, there's ice fishing to do on the lakes. Just come and enjoy what we have here. We're building a cultural, recreational, and ecological destination area here at Ness Creek and Nestlin Lake Campground. Just come.